I pretty much shoot all my videos in this sub 300 square foot apartment that me and my wife both live in. And because of that, I can't have stagnant top down rigs in my living room perpetually while I have people over. So this is the way I achieve my top down shots with just this tripod and this mobile mount. Now to start off, the table itself that I shoot the top-down shots on is a table from IKEA. It is wall-mounted and foldable and I think in small spaces, something wall-mounted or foldable is quite the saver. So yeah, this one's from IKEA. It costs about 3,500 rupees and it just props up like that and it has a, a leg that comes out and just gets into a groove and it becomes a table when I need it. Those uh, fake plants, uh, coincidentally, are from IKEA as well. You probably see them scattered around in some top-down shots. In terms of the tripod that I use, I have a full-size tripod by Digitech, but you can use any other full-size tripod. And yes, I have strategically placed this table near my window because sometimes I just use natural light to shoot top-down shots. And this couch somehow also plays an important role and you'll see how. So the main way to achieve this top-down shot is to somehow get an acute angle with your tripod. The way I do it is by just extending one of the three legs to its full capacity and the other two I place on the table itself. Of course, in order to kind of manage the weight of the phone on the other end, I place something like a counterweight on the extended leg of the tripod that is kind of wedged into this couch. It's generally a backpack or anything heavy that would just basically counterweight the weight of the phone on the other end of the tripod. And the reason this phone mount is important to this equation is because it is one of those phone mounts that help you mount your phone in a portrait or in a landscape mode. So that's horizontal or vertical. And all you got to do is mount this phone mount on the tripod and place it in such a way that it holds your phone in a portrait mode. Bend the neck of the tripod completely down so that the phone is parallel to the table and voila, you have your top down shot. Now, as I said, I strategically place this table close to the window because I mostly use natural light. So I'll just open up these blinds and I have light onto my subject. And as I also said, sometimes just for the aesthetics of it, I have something placed in the background like those IKEA plants. But at the same time, you don't want to take the focus off your subject. In my case, mostly it's a phone. So I keep it closer to the camera and I raise it with something that can't be seen in that uh, field of view. So it's either a long stemmed wine glass or a used tissue paper holder. I just place the phone on that, bringing it closer to the camera and uh, that kind of keeps your focus on the subject. Now, I have found a small contraption that helps me achieve this top down shot in just this little thing. But it's not really worth a full video, but I will be putting up a shot on YouTube and a reel on Instagram. So in order to get notified when that happens, don't forget to sub to the channel if you haven't and follow me on my socials. I have my links in the description. Until then, stay safe, stay sane and I'll see you guys in the next one. Cheers.